Susie Castillo, 23, Miss Massachusetts, USA. Massachusetts. Michigan. Next, we have Massachusetts. And Alabama, meet Massachusetts. A 23-year-old from Lawrence, Susie Castillo, has a bachelor's degree in design and interior architecture from Endicott College. She loves watercolor painting and dancing to Latin music with her mom. Give it up for Massachusetts. Here's the lovely Massachusetts. Continuing with Alabama. Something that I've been doing with my title actually is going to the schools and talking to kids because it's a, it's a low-income community. You always hear a lot about, you know, the crime and the drug abuse. And so something that I've been trying to do is going and showing them, look, I'm a neighbor. And I'm doing great things with my life, and you can too. Massachusetts. And next, Massachusetts. Hello, how are All you right. today? Hello. You come from a long line of tough women. I sure do. My grandmother had 19 children. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh. <laughs> There's girl power, huh? Tell me about grandma. There's girl power in my family. Well, they obviously didn't have cable in those days. They didn't. <laughs> my... Hey, babysitter, there's good news and bad news. There is. The babysitter, I'm sure, made a lot of money. But um, my family actually grew up in Puerto Rico. My mom was the only twin, the only set of twin that my mom had, um, that my grandmother had, I'm sorry. And, um, yeah, they grew up, 18 kids oh, all together. Unbelievable. Thank oh, you, Massachusetts. Thank you. Better her than me. <laughs> Next up, Texas. And now Massachusetts. Dig in, hand me a question. All right, this one comes from Alabama. What three items would you place in a time capsule to represent the 21st century? I would probably have to choose a cell phone, <laughs> makeup, <laughs> and then lastly, I think I would probably put a computer because I think it best, um, both I think the cell phone and the computer tell us a lot about the, our century's technology and everything that, that has evolved since then. Thank you, Massachusetts. <laughs> Massachusetts. <laughs> Texas.
All right, ladies, come on down. This is it. This is the big moment. Ho. Oh. Whoever wins the title will be representing the United States at the Miss Universe pageant in Panama. I can't take it. That's right. I can't stand it. If for any reason the new Miss USA can't fulfill her duties, this is very important. The first runner-up will then take over. All right, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? The first runner-up is... Alabama! And so, Miss USA 2003 is Massachusetts! Congratulations! Take your first walk as Miss USA 2003 Shante Hinton, the Burn the Floor dancers, the city of San Antonio, and of course, Billy Bush. And Daisy Fuentes, and to all the brave men and women overseas. We'll see everybody at the Miss Universe pageant in Panama. Good night, God bless, peace. Good night. Sheraton Four Points is proud to be the official delegate hotel for Miss USA 2003.